Thank you for watching our video on managing anesthesia for patients having robotic surgery. Robotic surgery is a minimally invasive surgical method in which the surgeon uses robotic systems to help him or her carry out difficult surgical operations. It is crucial for anesthetists to comprehend the particular difficulties of autonomous surgery in order to provide patients with a secure and efficient level of anesthesia. The best practices and anesthetic considerations for patients having robotic surgery will be covered in this video. A comprehensive preoperative assessment of the patient is crucial prior to any robotic operation. The patient's medical background, current medicines, food allergies, and any prior surgical or anesthetic experiences are all taken into consideration. The patient's airway must also be evaluated because robotic surgery frequently necessitates lowering the patient's head, which can impair respiration. The complexity of the operation, the patient's medical history, and the surgeon's preferences all play a role in the decision of the anesthetic technique to be used during robotic surgery. The majority of robotic surgeries are usually performed under general anesthesia because it completely relaxes all muscles and enables the surgeon to regulate the patient's breathing. In some circumstances, regional anesthesia such as spinal or lumbar anesthesia may also be used. Continuous patient monitoring is necessary during robotic surgery to guarantee the patient's safety and well-being. This entails keeping an eye on the patient's pulse rate, blood pressure, oxygen saturation, and carbon dioxide levels. The anesthetist will also keep an eye on the patient's degree of sedation and change the medication as necessary to maintain it. Post-operative recovery. To guarantee a quick recovery following robotic surgery, the patient will be closely watched in the post-anesthesia care unit, PACU. As required, the anesthetist will manage the patient's pain while continuing to monitor the patient's vital signs and state of consciousness. Once the patient is stable and awake, the PACU will usually release them. In order to ensure safe and effective anesthesia, the administration of anesthesia for patients having robotic surgery necessitates careful thought and planning. To give the patient the best treatment possible, the anesthetist must collaborate closely with the surgeon and the rest of the surgical team. We appreciate you viewing and hope you learned something from and were able to use this video. Thanks for watching.